Jesus said to him, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. John 14, verse 6. These words from Jesus are defining when it comes to what we believe and teach about how someone gets to heaven. Right now, it's popular to proclaim that there are many ways to God. The current teaching is that you can pick any world religion you want, and as long as you are sincere, it serves as an additional path to God. That may sound credible enough, but when you hold that notion up to the Word of God, it just doesn't hold water. Or other liberal theologians will teach a heresy called universalism. This teaching states that everyone is eventually going to end up in heaven no matter what they did in this life. When you reference Jesus' teaching regarding the separating of the sheep and the goats for all eternity, they argue that the Greek word translated eternity can also mean a long period of time and that although people might experience hell for a period of time, ultimately they will be ushered into heaven. Again, this teaching doesn't align with the clear teaching of Scripture. Sometimes I tell people, if you were God, you could dictate what is right and wrong. But since you are not God, we need to go to the instructions God has given us in the Bible. Jesus didn't say that there were many ways to God the Father or that everyone was going to go to heaven sooner or later. No, he said, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. He said it and that settles it. Let's go with his plan rather than the heresies that are contrived and propagated by others because it's the truth that will set you free. In the long run, you'll be glad you did. Press on in the Lord.